Hi guys, it's Lenormand time. So this is going to be mid-May to mid of June. So this is actually one of my favorites, if not the favorite. My uh, steady clients <laughs> just like, do Lenormand cat, please do Lenormand. It kind of like tells you, hey, look left and look right. This is who might be anticipating what can happen. You know, with Lenormand, you get lots of things that you Kind of like we hope for the best, but we prepare for the worst. And this is sort of like almost telling you, kind of like, hey, jump over this, etc., etc. So, also really quickly, uh, the school is starting on the 15th. So last call for this, kind of like check my website, catterra.ca, and check kind of like the schooling schedule. Uh, the second thing, my speed up promotion is still on, which is awesome. Instead of three weeks, you kind of get a reading within a week. And I also upgraded Rush, so instead of seven, you get it in a three days. And Urgent, which used to be three days turnaround, now you get it in 24 hours. So, um, if you kind of like really want to get a reading, this is a really good time because one thing that I miss in Canada is um, spring. We kind of transition from winter to the summer. So co just a couple of weeks ago, we had a snowstorm and now my uh, air conditioning is working like full force. So hence, I'm going to be spending some actual time with myself and with my close ones in the summer. So kind of like try to squeeze in yourself in time and so I also wished happy birthday and happy belated birthdays to all Tauruses as well as to birthdays for Gemini's who will be also uh, celebrating during this period so without much further ado guys I also ask you to please like share subscribe and comment and all the best love you Hi Gemini and welcome to your my May June uh, Lenormand reading. So to start with, I wish in advance happy birthday to Gemini. So I guess you didn't expect this early in May, but I know that you probably will coming and coming back to this reading. And this is always really exciting. What I do, I actually record my own Lenormand readings, which I love my favorite, and keep coming back to see how this works. And again, guys, this is a general reading, and of course, your own particular situation could be affected with many different factors. And these are kind of underlying energies. Generally, we have these two main significators, the lady and the gentleman. And I'll be your guide over here to tell you different stories that I see. So as you can see, there is like sort of like baby is in the corner over here as you can see you did put a baby in the corner over here it's kind of really weird because look at the latest significator is literally also in a corner both of them kind of like still looking at each other so i don't know if there is a partner or has been a partner or you know you want a partner it kind of look looks like i want it but i'm I'm either not able or not willing to go for it. There seem to be like some other, I would say more pressing issues over here for you. Um, this is definitely the house of a fidelity, right? And friends over here, right? The house of a dog. It could be that you're dealing with a coworker or someone 
uh, with whom you kind of have a project or things together. It could be somebody just as simply uh, that you're going to a fitness class with. But this kind of like I, I see an in indication of some kind of interest. But I also see those sharp words, and this is where my confusion is, right? Because we have the Sinister Seven cards in Lenormand, and they usually indicate kind of like, you know, um, issues that we can encounter with kind of like different gradations, with the mountain being sort of like the biggest one. And sort of like facing this mountain is like a facing a challenge, facing some kind of obstacle, right? Also, this mountain here has this like snow peak, so you might be dealing with somebody who is either blonde or has, um, I don't know, gray hair, salt and pepper kind of a thing. Maybe you're dealing with, with closure of some kind, because the coffin here is in the house of the man. You see, it's kind of weird because something is blocking you you know like i can see your heart chakra right like heart chakra is supposed to be green and it's like really fresh springy green and when it spins that way it kind of feels that everything is possible it kind of like we feel kind of like teenager likes and everything is good we start thinking along twin flames kind of things but when it doesn't, it starts being tinted with any color can be from the spectrum, including kind of like rust or orange, which almost like feels like, good gosh, you know, this is not functioning properly. I actually see that almost like to some extent, some of you are going to go through a period of, let's call it, um, deep freeze. <laughs> I would say, you know what, it's going to be like, get your stinking paws of me, you Game dirty ape kind of a thing. Leave me alone. I need to rest. Right? The the sun here is in the house of a fish, right? So which is right here to it. So I, I kind of like see that you'll really dedicate to your work, to your studies. Kind of like it's going to be the thing. This kind of like fulfills you also some of you have children that kind of like seems to be the world. There is something going on between you and a partner. Some of you may be dating or, as I said, significator are gender neutral. But for those of you that are starting to date, it looks like it's going to be, yes, dating, but super slow. It might feel kind of like weird. You see, whenever I see the cross, I'm always thinking about something karmic, right? The cross is in the house of the letter. So there's going to be something that will trigger, you know, like what trigger means, um, you know, like you can be 40 years old and lying on a beach and then you smell something that maybe reminds you, could be sort of like, let's say, coconut, right, the Coperton kind of a thing. It can kind of remind you back then to kind of like the Jodie Foster, remember that little kind of girl commercial. But it's not a commercial that is triggering you. It was something that you have been experiencing at that time that is just kind of overwhelming you. It's good or bad, right? And, and like sometimes there is like, I mean, circumstance that other people kind of like bring it to us because each person is sort of like a lesson in itself, right? With some of them uh, carrying more important lessons such as like those karmic lessons. Looks like that almost like general, I would say, advice for you would be sort of like that you have to go through that pregnant <laughs> pause, as they call it, right? Allow different ideas. You you really will know what the heck you want, what the heck you don't want. And you're putting yourself in a corner over here. As I said, you might be actually expressing yourself a lot in in uh, writing but like you are in the house of a tower so which also just like seems to be also residing over here so whether you're going to go through um trips some kind of like possibly even long distance trip this also can indicate right that it could be somebody from the past that you're reuniting with that somebody who still you're still happy but you're very unsure See, this person here comes with a bouquet and you come with a clover. So like they have two kind of like very kind of lucky cards, like only these two. But then the sky is cutting this one here. And also the lilies are in the house of uh, the clover. Which kind of again, it, it gives them the feeling 
I keep thinking blonde hair, I keep getting that kind of like vision, blonde hair, or, you know, gray hair, salt and pepper, keeps giving me men in particular, to be honest. And, and you can tell it's spring in Toronto when you hear this kind of sounds because everybody's working on their houses in the neighborhood. I, I really think that you kind of like are trying to figure out if something really works for you. And in the process, you are really, I would say, non-compromising. And giving the Q&R sign, um, I would say you're kind of being very self-protective and self-nurturing. It kind of like really, when I see it, is like it looks like a cocoon. Even though this person seemingly is bringing everything, hey, babe, I want to get uh, go out with you, or, you know, somebody is really kind of outwardly doing everything that seems to be, like, perfect. You are kind of, like, really thinking about all of that in a completely different way, right? Because the scythe is in the house of the scythe, and this is, like, when cards become, pff, they're, like, really screaming in your face. Something needs to be cut. Skype is always talking about something really um, sharp. Hence, it can talk about this bad conversation or, you know, honey, we need to talk. Where, especially if somebody announced that to you, like, you kind of, like, feel this, like, deep phrase, oh, no, he's breaking up with me or she's breaking up with me. Kind of a thing. But I, I really think, especially also you have the house in the house of the house. So this is, like, a second one that is kind of overlapping. So something is happening that is kind of like really for you needed to address the situation and the mountain is like saying I am keeping you there as long as you need to be because you need to be faithful to yourself the dog is in the house of the birds which kind of like means that maybe you're asking or waiting for some kind of um, results or decision or communication this also can be a gossip somebody could be gossiping about you and that can kind of create challenges in your life or you might even feel some of you would feel it's kind of weird I have like two types some of you will feel that you getting circumstances that almost like whatever I try kind of like really don't get anywhere and others will feel like oh my gosh you know my good deeds are kind of like being punished over here you know what they say no good deed remains unpunished but you know what, guys? It is temporarily, like it's karmic for both of you. It is like something that needs to be resolved and put to rest forever because the sun will shine again. It's just like, you know, you have to allow this, I would say, gestation period to go through um, kind of like projects that maybe you had, uh, especially maybe something that you were doing with children, maybe it will shift, maybe they will change. Um, they might kind of like, they may kind of like end up being different, you know, like it's like sometimes you get what you want and sometimes you get what you need, which kind of turns out to be what you want in the end, right? So I would also say that even though here, and this could have been that already like has been passed, it have been some kind of arguments, I would just like for a time being put them on ice because right now um, I would say that you're a little bit too weak to... Um, even argue you need to almost like conserve your own energy and nothing beneficial would come at this time from arguing or from debating or dissecting self-care is the most important activity right now so reflect read a good book um, maybe you feel blockage to how to get to kind of like a better financial situation like I mean but the truth is First and foremost, take care of yourself. Get to lots of rest. Try to distract yourself and not to do the same thing you were doing over and over. Do not try to be the dead horse and things will start to look up. You just simply have to go through that period which kind of is making you, it's healing you. You know, it's almost like when you put a band-aid on something to kind of protect from the environment and then you rip it off and just like you finished the final stages of healing. So something like that will be for you. So Gemini, uh, hopefully this helps. I guess for your private reading for just your own energy, contact me via keter.ca. I also appreciate if you guys subscribe, like, 
and share. And of course, I enjoy reading your comments. Thank you so much. All the best. And I think you guys will really advise to people to kind of like keep their paws to themselves. Okay, all the best. Love ya. Ha 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 ha!